In this video, we will learn about how to create a hexagonal prism which is resting on the horizontal plane on one of its base edges. And also the axis of the solid is inclined at 30 degree to HP. So to achieve this, let's draw a pentagonal prism with the pentagon profile on the horizontal plane that is a top plane. So first let us draw a hexagonal profile on the top plane with one edge vertical and then let's try to extrude it for a height of 50 mm and then let's make the whole solid inclined at an angle of 30 degree. Let's try to create this by using Autodesk Fusion. Click on create sketch. Select the top plane. And draw the hexagon. So the given profile is hexagon with the side 25 mm. So to do that, select the polygon command. You can use any one of this option. So I am choosing the circumscribed polygon. And select the center point here. And draw a hexagon. While you are drawing, make sure one edge is nearer to vertical. So let me click over here and make sure one edge is vertical. So apply the vertical constraint to one edge. Then dimension any one of the side. So the side is 25 mm. Change the dimension to 25 mm. Now finish the sketch. Now let's try to extrude this for a given height. So the height of the solid is 50 mm. So let's try to extrude this one for 50 mm. Automatically the profile will be selected. If it is not selected, go here and select the profile. So here the distance of the extrusion is 50. So type 50 in the box and then give OK here. So now we have created the prism with the axis vertical. You can see here in the front view, the axis is vertical. And in the top view, you can see the hexagon. So you can see the hexagon. In this, let's assume this edge is resting on the HP. And then we are trying to tilt the object in such a way that it makes an angle of 30 degree with the horizontal plane. So to do the rotation, let's go to modify and select move or copy. So it will ask you to select the body which you want to rotate. So select this body. And then for the move type already defaultly the rotate is enabled. If it is not enabled, Click here to enable the rotate move type and then for the axis select this particular edge so that you can see here the axis of rotation is enabled at that particular edge and try to move the solid like this so it will change your angle the angle of rotation so if you see from the front so this is the angle of rotation and they have given that from the horizontal plane it is 30 degree and now it is moving from the vertical axis. So you should give as 90 minus theta that is 90 minus 30 degree is 60 degree. Then only it, you can able to achieve the angle of 30 degree with the horizontal. Now click OK to confirm it. Now we have achieved the rotation of the hexagonal prism with its axis inclined at 30 degree with the horizontal plane that is 60 degree with the vertical axis from the vertical axis that is z axis. Now if you see the top view you can see the view of the hexagonal prism on the top view and this is the front view final front view of the hexagonal prism for the given angle. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.